Father, and praise and glorify be your name forever, man. Let your first go, Lord, be a part as we do pour our hope on you. Blessed are you, O Lord, teach me thy statutes. Lord, you have been our refuge from all generations. I said, be merciful to me. Heal my soul, for I have sinned against me. Lord, I bless you, teach me to be will. You are my God, for you is the fountain of life, and in your light we shall see light. Oh, continue your mercy to those who know you. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. <coughs> holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Oh, now and ever unto the ages of the age, amen. Holy mortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty. Holy and mortal, have mercy on us. Having risen from the tomb and having burst the bond of Hades, thou that destroy the steps of death, O Lord, delivering all from the snares of enemy, manifesting thyself to thy apostles, thou that send them forth to preach, and to them thou hast granted thy peace to the world, and thou alone art plenteous and great mercy. Christos was blessed. Christ is risen. Christos and Esti. Christos and the Yacht. Christ is risen. Christ is in the dead, trampling down death by death in the bondage of the tombs of heavy life. We trust us that as a humanity is left of God, we search him of God by the body of God. Christ is in the dead, trampling down death by death in the bondage of the tombs of his holy life. Blessed is the kingdom of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever into ages of ages. Oh, 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 oh,
Thou wilt save us and mercy us and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Amen. 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 Our most holy, most pure, most blessed, and glorious Lady, thou art all blessed and ever virgin, grant with all the saints. Let us commend ourselves and each other and all our lives unto Christ our God. Amen. Thou art a good God, love us mankind, and cleaning us for our glory. To the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever to ages of ages.
Let us attend peace be unto all. Wisdom. O Lord, save your people and bless your inheritance. O Lord, save thy people and bless your inheritance. Wisdom. Greeting in the acts of St. Paulus. Let us attend. Now in these days when the disciples were increasing in number, the Hellenists murmured against the Hebrews because of their wisdom when neglecting the daily distribution. And the twelve summoned the body of the disciples and said, It is not right that we should give up preaching the word of God to serve tables. Therefore, brethren, pick out from among you seven men of good repute, full of spirit and wisdom, whom you may appoint to this duty. We would devote ourselves to prayer and the ministry of the word. And what they said but pleased the whole multitude, and they just stepped on the man full of faith and of the Holy Spirit. And Philip, and the Prochorus, and Nicola, and Timon, and Parmenius, and Nicolas, a proselyte of Antioch, these they set before the apostles, and they prayed and laid their hands on them. And the word of God increased, and the number of disciples multiplied greatly in Jerusalem, and a great many of priests were obedient to the faith. Be unto you who has wept to us. Side, dressed in a white robe, and they were amazed. 
And the man said to them, Do not be amazed. You see Jesus of Nazareth, who is crucified. He is risen, he is not here. See the place where they lay him. But go tell his disciples and Peter that he is going before you to Galilee. There you will see him as he told you. And the women went out and fled from the tomb. For trembling and astonishment had come upon them. And they said nothing to anyone, for they were The Father and the Son, the Holy Spirit, Amen. Christ is risen. He is risen. Christ 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 is risen. And finally, Christ is risen. So, if you read in different Gospels, there are different accounts of today's mirror woman story. In Matthew, it says that when the women were walking and talking about who's going to roll the stone away and what we're going to do and the soldiers are going to be there. And it says in Matthew that there was a seal when they first put Christ into the tomb. Two ribbons with hot wax and then the seal of the, of the Roman emperor with the letters SVQR, which is Latin for, I'm paraphrasing here, Stay away. This is Roman property. Okay? So the women knew that. They were terrified. So as they're walking, with all those doubts of what are we supposed to do, in Mark it says that as they were walking, they encounter some men on the side of the road. Asking them where they're going. And they say, we're going to go to try to anoint our master with spices. And they keep walking. Now think about that, my dear brothers and sisters in Christ. Because it kind of relates to our own lives, our own life situations. We live in those circumstances where sometimes we know that things are going to be really tough. Things are going to be hard and difficult. Sometimes we get afraid and we don't do what we're supposed to do. We back away, right? The women still came with their spices. Yes, they were worried. Yes, they were afraid. They still came to the tomb. And what happened when they came? We know the story, right? The stones rolled away. They see a man who really is an angel, but they see a man saying, what are you doing here? And again, they explain themselves. We're here to annoy our master. He's not here. He's risen. Go. Share the good news. A couple things we need to be mindful of. That seal that the Roman guards put on it, right? That says stay away from the Roman property. We have the same seal put on our hearts, but from God at our baptism, at our chrismation. 
If you were here with us Holy Saturday, when Tyler and, and Anthony were baptized, the whole church said, the seal, as we sealed them with the gift of the Holy Spirit, the seal, right? We have that seal. We have that power of the Holy Spirit. Now, of course, Father still has to challenge all of us. We don't act like we have the seal. In the possible season, we are, we are supposed to be the ones to transform the world. Yes, we are. We're supposed to be the ones to say, at work, at home, with our neighbors, Christ is risen. What does that mean? And then explain to them what that means. And while we greet one another with Christ is risen. We're not supposed to walk around back to work to the weather. No! What are we doing? The seal! We have that power. We have that glory. Shame on us for being sad and downcast. One of my brothers at the funeral of Father Angelo, my dear brother in Christ, we sat there in the pew and he said, oh man, it's so sad. I mean, poor Patricia. I said, Stop! He's, with, he's where, he wants, where he wanted to be, where we all want to be, with Christ. You don't think his family knows that? Of course they do. That knowledge will transform their grief into joy. But we put so much effort and energy into the stuff of this world. Yikes. God help us. Really, God help us. All of our efforts in this world, if it's not with God and glorifying Him, means nothing. And when we go to a tomb and see it, it is an empty tomb. But we don't realize it's because He's risen. Because we haven't been using that seal, the power of the Holy Spirit. As St. Paul says, to our condemnation. This morning, remember the Murbear women. They had the courage, knowing the obstacles facing them, they had the courage to still come and to be as, as attentive to their master as possible. And notice at the end, Mark says they were too afraid to say anything to anybody. Matthew says, they went out through the streets of Jerusalem, shouting the news, and they went to see the disciples, the eleven. I'll leave it to you to choose which one you want to believe. Because the Lord is risen for all of us. Christ is risen. Let us say with all of us, all of our mind, let us say, Lord have mercy. Lord and God, our fathers, we pray, hearken and have mercy. Lord have mercy. Have mercy on us, O God, according to thy great goodness, we pray thee, hearken and have mercy. Lord have mercy. Grace or for the missionary today, for priesthood and all the clergy, all of our brethren in Christ. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. All the prayer of the present of our country, also those our armed forces and members of our royal family. Patriarchs, who bless the noble fathers of this holy house, all of our fathers, mothers, brothers, and sisters, the Orthodox departed this life before us, especially the departed Archpriest Angelo, the Archpriest Sir William, Eugene, John, Becky, Amelia, Marsha, Olga, Eli, Rabia, Joseph, Melissa, Alex, Noble, and Alex, and Daniel, 
who here in all the world lie asleep in the blood. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. All give me pray for mercy, life, peace, out, salvation, visitation, for the servants of God are ill, Charles, the handmaid, Neva, Melba, John, Madeline, Melanie, Helen, Melba, Dorian, Dorothy, Betsy, Nancy, Stephanie, Stella, Gary, Dolores, Margaret, and Milan, and with a pardon remission of their sins. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Our can we pray for those who bring up for the good works for the total number of the house, for those who labor, those who sing, and for all the people who are present, who await thy grave. And rich mercy. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Without the mercy of the Lord of mankind, and to the obvious heart of glory, to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever into angels of angels. All get again in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Wisdom, the God of always, by thy might be ascribed glory unto thee, to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever to ages of ages. Now 
Now Christian, the promise of their affairs, and the soul of their wars. May the Lord God remember his kingdom, always now and ever, to ages of ages. His grace of Father Bishop, be today, all those of the priests of the African Ostrogoders. May the Lord God remember his kingdom. Always, now we have heard of two ages of ages. Because of our country and all civil authorities, our armed forces and members of our royal family, may the Lord God remember this kingdom. Always, now we have heard of two ages of ages. The sick and the suffering and all those who have asked us, on whom the be to pray for them, especially the handmaid of God, Eva, and the servant of God, Charles, all those in hospitals, nursing homes, personal care homes, and prisons, and institutions, may the Lord God remember this kingdom, always, now and ever, and up to ages of ages. All of our fathers, mothers, brothers, and sisters, the Orthodox, the farthest life before us, in faith and hope of the resurrection. May the departed servant of God, my brother in Christ, and can celebrate the Archpriest Angelo, the servants of God, Alex, Mildred, Daniel, Radha, Barnett, Stella, Dragon, Helen, James, Nicola, Bill, Yubitsa, Mika, and George. May the Lord God remember this kingdom, always, now and ever, and unto ages. Of ages. You and all Orthodox Christians, may the Lord God remember in his kingdom always, now and ever, and up to ages. Of
Singing and triumphing here, shouting, proclaiming, and saying, Send down the Holy Spirit upon us and upon these gifts of offering. And make this bread the precious body of thy Christ. Amen. Amen. And that was in this cup the precious blood of thy Christ. Amen. 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 Making the change of thy Holy Spirit. Amen. 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 That they may be to those who take the fair face of the soul, commission of sin, and communion the Holy Spirit. For those who so many of you have been boldness toward the judgment of the nation. I turn it off as a reasonable worship for those that fall asleep in the faith. Ancestors, fathers, patriarchs, prophets, apostles, preachers, evangelists, martyrs, confessors, ascetics, and every righteous spirit made perfect in faith. Especially with our most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious lady, the pale thought of the devil, Virgin Mary.
Father Bishop in the air. Grant him holy churches in peace. Save thee, honor of the length of days. Write to define the word of thy truth. And grant that with one mouth and one heart we pray the majestic name of the Father and of the Son and the Holy Spirit. Now and ever to angels of angels. And the mercies of our great God and Savior Jesus Christ shall be with all of you. And with your spirit. Now remember all the same, and together again in peace, let us pray to the Lord. For the churches which have been sanctified, let us pray to the Lord. For all one of those mankind which came upon this holy and inaugural altar is a sweet spirit of fragrance. Well, send down upon us the divine grace and the gift of the Holy Spirit. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord for in small affliction, wrath, pain, and necessity, let us pray to the Lord. Lord Help us, save us, and mercy us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Let the holy, perfect, holy, peaceful, and sinless let us ask for the Lord. Amen. 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 Repentance, let us ask for the Lord. After sharing with one thy friends, let us be peaceful and bring thee friends before the great judgment seat of Christ. Let us ask for the Lord. Having asked you to say to you, the Holy Spirit, let us commend ourselves to each other and all life unto Christ our God. For the big ass, bloody cause, so there's no man, no such man, no. Smear to the silver, to the look at the best of the world outside. Be God, hold up to me. God of Torah's sons, who is the life's love, all that is near is God of the heart. In the priest, my warrior, give your call. Peace be unto all. Thy spirit. Thy words unto all.
through the grace and compassion and love toward mankind and the begotten Son with whom thou art blessed, together with the Holy Good and thy breathing spirit, now and ever to ages of ages.
بخشد است اتی بزرگان با دایگرس As we go, may we perfect, holy, peaceful, and sinless, let us commend ourselves and each other and all our lives unto Christ our God. We thank you, O Lord, to love us, mankind, and the of our souls, and that was made us worthy this day, that we mourn our mysteries. May each make our paths, make us all life here. Quite our life, make firm our steps to the prayer of the intercession of the glorious. They all call for us another Virgin Mary of all thy saints. For thou art sanctification to the obedient God and glory, to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, now and then unto angels of angels. Let us depart in peace. Sanctifies those who trust in thee, save thy people and bless thy inheritance, preserve the fullness of thy church, sanctify those of the view of thy house, glorify them in front of the divine power, and forsake us not, who put our hope in thee. Give peace to thy world, to thy churches, to thy priests, to all those in civil authority, to all thy people, for every good gift and every perfect gift from above, and the doctrine of all their plights, and to thee we ascribe glory, thanksgiving, and worship. To the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever to ages of ages. Of our holy saints and teachers, our patrons, Saint Saba, 
sen seminersen yine sinersen bilim çadır bir zaman sonra da ben bu seni kolay bir şeyci ol, ben bu seni çok madalya bulup bu seni başlarım Jackson, ben de ben bu seni yen the Iron Martyr Bishop of Persia this day, of the Holy and Righteous Ancestors of God, Joachim and of all the saints, have mercy upon us and save us. For his glory and for his the prayers of the Holy Father, the Lord Jesus Christ, our God, have mercy upon us and save us. Christ is risen. He is risen. God bless you, inspiring today. You took it to a different level. Two corrections on the bulletin. Wait, Steve's got an announcement. Do your five corrections. Oh, five corrections. Two corrections. I said two. Uh, right after the distribution of Nafta, we will have the Parastos for the departed members of, of Dorothy Icach's family. You're welcome to stay up for that. The fellowship hour is hosted by George and Marsha Sushnar downstairs. Um, first correction the open house for our Slava next Saturday is probably, well, I shouldn't say, it, it may not happen. So, right now, we're going to say it's not going to happen because of our cousin Eva's condition. But if it isn't going to happen, we'll let you know. We'll get the word out to everyone. Whatever. That's the officer. The boss is Should have checked with her first. I, I did. <laughs> also, the second correction. Sunday, June the 4th is Pentecost. Uh, we, we're, we're technically going to schedule a fellowship hour presentation by Mark Valentich on retirement planning. But because Dean reminded me that's the Koloslava, we'll have the Koloslava and the celebration downstairs. So we're going to cancel that and move that to a later date in, in, in the fall. Okay. Um, who's little Didi? Oh, Denise Branasevic celebrates her birthday last Friday. last Friday, and she's a very young Denise. Sounds the choir seen many years. Grant the Lord a peaceful life, help salvation, and further into all good things. The bad men of God, Denise, her family, friends, and loved ones, preserve her, Lord, for many years. 